Hello everyone, it's Jenna Ryan with Self Love You. We're here today to talk to you about how to love yourself more. Today's video, I'm feeling feisty. Must warning. Warning, I am feeling very feisty. <sighs> Just everything going on. Anyway, today I'm going to talk to you about the coronavirus and the narcissist who is discarding you during the coronavirus. I've heard this from multiple sources. Many of the people I'm coaching are, not everyone. So if this is not you, do not feel left out, okay? It's not, I mean, it's actually a good thing to be discarded by the narcissist. But a lot of the people that I work with have literally gone into discard right when the lockdown of the world has taken place. And um, that is, has been a recurring theme that the narcissist at that moment of need, the moment when your whole world has been just basically turned upside down, where is the narcissist? They don't give a reason, or sometimes they do give a reason. Sometimes they're holed up in quarantine with their other lover, with the person they're cheating on you with. And I just wanna say, I have compassion for you. However, I am not going to feel sorry for you because that's not the mood I'm in right now. You deserve compassion. You deserve empathy. You deserve healing. And you're going to get out of this relationship. I guarantee it if you work on yourself and do the work. However, I'm going to ask you this question. Why have you given your power away to this person? Your ability to be at peace is stuck somewhere over there. You don't even know where they are. And I'm saying take that power back now. Shut that door. Don't let them discard you because you are going no contact. By golly, you're going no contact during coronavirus. And you're going to do that by listening to videos like Self Love You. And these videos are going to get into your soul and seep into you. And you're going to get stronger through this lockdown. You're going to get stronger every day and you're going to find within you that power that rebellion against the the control of the narcissist that's trying to make you sad and depressed you are going to overcome this situation you are going to go no contact and you are going to go no contact good because it's your power and you're tired of giving away your power and you deserve to have a peaceful a peaceful, a happy, a joyous, a fulfilling, a productive, a progressive life. You deserve that. And you know that. And so your coronavirus, no coronavirus, it matters not. We're rising above all of the circumstances to take care of our hearts, to take care of our inner child that deserves protection, that deserves to have a chance to be free from the hurt and the pain and the longing of being attached to someone who is dumping on you, who's projecting their negative aspects on you, who's trying to control your emotions, who's trying to keep you bound and tied up and unable to be in a healthy relationship. So you're, you're stuck on this person and they're causing drama. And if they're not doing discard, they're definitely causing drama because the narcissist is freaked out right now. If you're freaked out, if normal, empathetic, healthy people are freaked out, if codependent people are freaked out, narcissists are freaked out too. And you're not about to be party to their ups and downs and mood swings and decisions to leave and decisions to stay and not being sure and being uncertain. There's enough uncertainty with, with the virus going around. You don't need a bunch of this other drama from the one that you supposedly love the one that's supposed to love you, which that there's no love involved with the narcissist because they're immature, emotionally immature. And you, my friend, are here on this channel to get healing, hope, fulfillment. Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm doing coaching and it is incredible. We, I'm, I'm seeing, I'm, this lockdown has really caused me to ramp up my coaching and I am, woo, 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 woo. we're getting down with it. It's incredible. Anyway, so um, you guys, you guys, you take your power back. You take your power back from the narcissist. Do not cry another tear for that person, that woman, that man, that person who has treated you less than. 
You are not less than. You are equal. You are worthy and they are missing out on a really great thing. You, and you're not even a thing, a really great human being with empathy. They are going to be the ones that are missing your feelings because when you don't give a crap, when you don't give a care, they know it energetically. They can feel it. They're losing their hold over you. They're losing their power over you. You're gaining your own power and they can't stand it. And you're not here to make them, you don't care how they feel. They can feel, their, their feelings do not matter to you because you are moving on with your life. You've got better fish to fry, bigger fish to fry, better things to do. And you are feeling sassy today. And you are feeling like you can do this. You're not the victim. You're not, you have not fallen prey to learned helplessness. You are a powerful warrior. You are a powerful person who has the capacity to shut the door to negative maltreatment. You have the power to walk away from people that do not treat you with respect. You are nobody's doormat. So you are standing up right now in this coronavirus, even if they're discarding you, even if they're treating you like dog's poo. It doesn't matter because that's a good thing. Bye. Don't let the door hit you in the butt. Bye, Felicia. Bye, Felicia. That was the best thing that ever happened to me was the lockdown and you went, you discarded me. Thanks. You did me a big favor. I appreciate it because I've been taking this time to read books, to read books, to read books. This is drama of the gifted child. I have taken this time and I'm not talking about me. I'm talking about my coaching clients. We, you, myself, loveys, until I think of a better... That's what we're called right now. self loveies. I want to think of more of a warrior term. Like, Ugh! because I'm tired of being pushed around. And I'm tired of seeing my people in my coaching and you lovely people who are listening to me. I'm tired of seeing you get pushed around. And I'm tired of seeing you get used. And I'm tired of seeing you get hurt. And I'm tired of seeing you get punched in the gut for nothing. I want to see you thrive. And I want to see you survive. And I want to see you be your best self. And I want to see you overcome all of this bologna. And I want to see you with a healthy person. And I want to see you let love in. And I want to see you love yourself. And I want to see you take up for yourself. And I want to see you take set your boundaries. And now is a perfect time. So if you have been discarded during coronavirus, hallelujah. Praise God. It's a great time to be discarded by the narcissist because that means you no longer have to submit to their control. You never had to and you still don't have to. Now it's just more of a time because if you're hurting and you're coming to this video, then you're going to learn way more than you ever dreamed from this difficult situation. Rumi says the light is the wound is where the light enters you. Your pain is going to be your gain if you stand up. Take a stand for yourself calmly, peacefully, but with your own power. And that's what's going to happen, you guys. This is a short video. If you're interested, I am doing a self-love you coaching call. It's going to be every Friday, okay? It's going to be practical steps, tips, accountability for self-love, self-care, personal development, healing, and getting out of toxic relationships. It's going to be a Zoom call. And it's going to be big. It's going to be huge. And lots of people are going to be there. You, there. you can still sign up. I'm not worried. I don't care. I know people are going to come because it's going to be amazing. And I'm feeding people with this healing that I have. And I can't wait. So tomorrow is our first one. If you're interested, you have to just email me at selfloveyouonline at gmail.com. How do I get in the Self Love You Zoom call on Fridays? And I will let you know there is a small fee for it, but it will definitely, you'll get way more than the money you pay. Okay, so definitely do that. This is Jenna Ryan. Until next time, I will talk to you soon.